Low funding and multiple taxes are two key factors affecting the growth of livestock sector in Kenya. This is according to a report by Kenya Markets Trust, an organization working with private sector farms, which is now recommending a raft of measures to unlock the sector's potential, as Denis Otieno reports. The report titled Political Analysis of the Livestock Sector indicates that the sector is grossly underfunded, hardly getting more than 6% of the total budgetary allocations in their respective counties. And despite actually accepting and acknowledging the fact that their, their livelihood is dependent on livestock, but when it comes to allocation, they give very minimal allocation to the livestock sector. The report also cites economic and financial constraints brought about by a number of taxes imposed by counties on livestock and livestock products. We can have different counties coming together through the regional blocks and then be able to harmonize some of the rules so that what is being charged in Garesa is the same or more or less the same as what is being charged in Wajia. Kenya is currently ranked third largest holder of livestock in Africa behind Ethiopia and Botswana. This according to data from the Kenya National Bureau of Statistics. Kenya's livestock sector contributes about 12% to the country's gross domestic product and supports the livelihood of over 10 million people. Despite this potential, stakeholders believe the sector is largely neglected. We also need to enhance quality improvements of the livestock and livestock products by scaling up extension services, which we also found is a very big problem, particularly in the pastoralist community. Besides increasing budgets and harmonizing laws and regulations, the report urges counties to provide investment incentives to private sector while sensitizing pastoralist communities in the country about quality livestock. Denis Otieno, Citizen TV.